Hey guys, Drac here, giving y'all another video of a review on a cutscene from Mad TV. Uh, the video is Mad TV stole my parking space. Uh, pretty much, uh, there these people get into a collision, and uh, this lady violently keeps on ramming the back of this man's vehicle with his kids in the back seat uh, as as they're arguing a the a uh, police officer pulls up and gets the information and this lady admits to trying to run this man and his family off of a cliff stating she, it, it would have worked if they hadn't have had to make them two turns and if she wouldn't have had to stop at the, a railroad crossing uh, pretty much uh, it, it pretty much explains itself whenever I play the video again uh, there this is just their view uh, there's going to be scenes that I skip to and scenes that I actually, and scenes, there's going to be scenes I'll play and there's going to be times I skip to a certain scene to the video. Uh, since this lady admits to threatening this man and his family trying to run him off the cliff and admits to making it making it manslaughter uh then uh she gets arrested for attempted uh making it manslaughter for which in the state of oklahoma is a felony and and can be punishable by a by imprisonment of 25 years to life, which is the max in the state of Oklahoma. So, without further ado, I'm going to start this video and pretty much it'll explain itself. Thank you and enjoy. Are you crazy? Are you absolutely out of your mind? Because we're trying to drive her and you drive us off the cliff. What is wrong with you? All right, all right, all right. Calm down. Everybody calm down. Right, calm down, calm down, sir. So pretty much what it just stated here is what y'all saw here is pretty much then the this man and uh this other lady fighting because she claims he had stole her parking space. Pretty much in the next part it'll explain that she'll start saying the man will start explaining about how this lady was following him for 20 miles and just like I said previously ramming the back of the man's vehicle violently trying to run his him and his family off the cliff. Sir, I'll start with you. Can you tell me your name and what happened? Yeah, my name is Jamie Shepler, and, and, and I, uh, earlier today, I took my family to the mall, okay, and then when we finished our shopping, I got into my car, we're driving on the freeway, the next thing I know, this woman is violently ramming our car from behind, and my kids are in the back seat. <laughs> Ma'am, did you do this? Yes, I did. See that, and you see, that is pretty much the messed up part. Him, this man and his family did nothing to deserve being rammed several times and followed I mean pretty much this lady just ex explained that and admitted that she tried to that she did it on purpose uh, so let's hear what she has to say throughout the video she deliberately slammed into the back of our car because she thought we took 
a parking spot. I'm sure that's not what she, you're saying. Is that, is that what you're saying, man? No, that's exactly what I'm saying. That man took my spot. See, she's crazy. Okay. Ma'am, um, may I have your name, please? My name is Evil Criddle, and I saw that spot first, so I had... She's following us for 20 miles. And there it is right there. Uh, she does admit that she has admitted that or claimed to uh, this man take, taking her parking space. So she deliberately decided to do what she did. Thankfully, not, nobody got hurt. And of course this man is right. This lady is pretty crazy trying to run them off run them off the road. And I tried to lose her in these hills and she tried to run us off of a cliff. Ma'am, did you try to run this man and his family off of a cliff? Yes, I tried that. I almost had a couple of those hairpin turns. Unbelievable. But see, he pulled into my pocket. So you tried to kill me? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes, sir. And there it is. She pretty much just admitted that she tried to kill this man and his family. So, therefore, at, in my personal opinion, if I would have been this officer, I would have stopped her right there instead of getting any more information and took her in right then. Got a statement from this man um, and took uh, the lady in for attempted manslaughter. Uh, like I said, that is a, a felony. And let's finish out this video. And if I hadn't had to stop at that railroad crossing, we wouldn't be having this conversation. <laughs> but see, officer, they have pulled into my parking Ma spot. Now I want to know what you can do. Do you about realize that. what you are saying? Yes, I do realize it. But see, I don't like to walk far, and that spot was close. I can't believe I'm so hearing this. Why. She's saying that she would kill my kids. Are you saying that you would kill my kids because we made you walk far? Yes, I would kill you. <laughs> I had to circle around for that spot. That's sick, okay? And besides that, there were like four other open spots there. But see, I needed the spot close to the garden center because I needed to get me a shovel. It's it, 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 irrelevant why you need a shovel. I don't, I don't need to know that. But I needed that shovel to brain my neighbor's dog. Miss Criddle, don't say anything more about the shovel. But my neighbor's sprinklers keep hitting my car. And so that's why I was Oh my god, the lady. Dog. You were planning on killing someone's dog because your car got wet? Yes, that was my plan. <laughs> but see, those sprinklers keep hitting that car like that. And that wears that's on enough. that paint job. All right, that, that and is, so that's I why I needed that. to go get that shovel. Miss Criddle, but don't it was heavy, so I Miss Criddle, don't tell me anything. But he pulled into my spot, so I had to kill him and his kid. <laughs> All right. Can you hold this for me, please? Miss Criddle, I'm going to have to place you under arrest for attempted vehicular manslaughter. Okay, good. But that man took my spot. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say, Ken, will be held against you in a court of law. That's fine, but that shovel was heavy. I'm going to tell him that. You cannot provide yourself with that shovel will be provided for you by the state. Well, sound good, but see, when her sprinklers hit my car like that, that just ain't right. I had to go get me that shovel. Yes, I do. I sure do. But